I'm only chasing after bags. Now I got a game plan. And I'm out here with the whoop. 700, three out fives. Look alive, look alive. Niggas came up on this side. Now they still good. to my channel if you're new here my name is Nisi if you return to hey my flare squad so how y'all doing today so of course y'all already know what this is this is our Thursday vlog so what I did so far today um I already put some clothes in the washer normally that's what I do on Thursdays I wash my clothes and stuff and try to do like a lot of cleaning because I have to work every single weekend unless I take off so I did that, put my load in the washer now, I just gotta put in the dryer. Y'all know when y'all hear something, you just stop and look. <laughs> I definitely hear something out there, and I don't know what it is. Let's look on the ring to see who's out there. Probably that dang on cat. Must be downstairs. It's either it's downstairs or the cat is right at my door at the bottom. That's why I don't see it. Anyway, so of course, if you've been watching some of my vlogs, some of y'all know, some of y'all don't. I still cannot smell from like three years ago when I had COVID. Sorry, y'all, if y'all see that little dot in my camera. I need to get a new camera, but I still can't smell. So told myself I'm going to really start being consistent. Of course, the doctors cannot do anything. They say it's a weighted game. But one of the things I can do is sniff some things that has a really, really strong smell for like 20 seconds. So I do the coffee and I do the oregano. I'm always saying this word, <laughs> word wrong. I do that. And then I, sometimes I'll do the... Um, I'll light the sage and then I'll smell the sage because the sage is like a real strong smell too. So yeah, that's what I'm going to start doing. I just need to be the consistent because I really want my smell back. It's just not good. It has its pros and cons. <laughs> of course, it's good way. I don't have to smell stinky stuff, but I want to smell my food cooking. I want to smell when I'm baking. I want to smell when I wear my perfume. I want to smell if I, somebody else is wearing perfume or cologne and stuff, but I'm just fingers crossed. I'm going to just pray I get it back. So, yeah. So, let's talk about my birthday. When I tell you, I really, really, really enjoyed myself. I had so much fun. For the most part, by myself. <laughs> so, my friend, my co-worker, she did go um, out to eat with me when I went to have dinner. And then the rest of the weekend, for the most part, I was by myself. For, like, Friday and part of Saturday. And then, I don't know. Uh, yeah, y'all see anyway, I went to the movies, went to go see Color Purple with my friend when I came back into town. That was a lot of fun. It's crazy, we've been friends for like a minute, like, what's, has it been two years, something like that? And this is our first time actually hanging out, so I'm going to try to do that more often. And um, so like, I really, really enjoyed myself. It's like, if I'm not traveling, like going out of town, and let's talk about that, I will be out of the country next year. <laughs> I took like two years of not traveling. I'm just trying to be mindful of, you know what I'm saying, not living above my means and stuff like that. When I travel, I'm not going to like another state. I want to go out of the country. So I want to make sure I have the funds and stuff to do that. So, um, but me and my sister definitely will be out of the country next year. And, but I really enjoyed myself and I, I had so much fun from going out to eat, from going back to the hotel, um, 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 decorating and doing that little thing that I recorded like taking that um that the bubble bath and stuff like that with the rose palace and stuff like that from booking me a hotel in Tennessee going there trying out a couple of the restaurants and stuff like that and just exploring and like you know their little the railway thing that I did I really enjoyed it you know and that's what I like to do but yeah I just, I'm just saying that to say it's okay. It's all about self-love. It's okay to do things by yourself. A lot of people say, I don't see how you do that. I don't see how you do it. 
I love it. I'm a loner anyway, so it don't matter. So me celebrating my birthday by myself, I ain't got to worry about what people say, yeah, I want to go. Then when the time comes, they change my mind. And also, my birthday is like three days after Christmas. So people always say that they broke. They don't got no money anyway. So it is what it is. <laughs> so yeah, so y'all, I want to remember in my birthday vlog, I showed y'all this. This is the bag. My friend had got me this. This is for, I'm going to say Christmas and birthday. Because she gives me like six or seven gifts. And this is for both Christmas and birthday. So let's put our first money in it. So I had got a couple of cash. I got some cash that I think just like ten dollars, like ten ones. We're gonna put it in here. We're gonna put it right in here. So yeah, this thing, I really like it. When I, I seen somebody post this on their vlog and I was like, oh, I need to get one of those. You literally cannot get nothing out of it unless you take a hammer and you break it. That's the only way you can get out of it. Stuff out of it. So I'm going to just keep putting money in this all year round. And then on my birthday is when we're going to break it. And I'm going to open it and we're going to see how much money we got saved up. And then I got these. I got some $2 bills. My friend gave me these. She gave me like, she gave me a, 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 um, a free wild one. So this is four I'm putting in here. And also, um... She told me that these are for good luck. I did not know that. I actually got one in my wallet. So I'm going to keep it with me at all times. I really did not know that it was for good luck. Nowadays, I never use cash. Never. So like every weekend when I go to work, I'm going to just make it my business to get some cash out the ATM. So I can put it in my bank. Okay, so. so we got our first saving some money in there so yeah so what i'm about to do is i'm going to make a wreath i want to make a valentine's day wreath because one thing about me i love love i may be single and i may not felt love yet or they have not felt me <laughs> but i love love i love everything about it you know what i'm saying so i'm going to make me a valentine's day wreath um these are the colors i'm going to show you these are the colors i'm going to do i got red white and pink yeah i think i'm really recording like three or four videos today so make me the reef and i'm gonna cook a little bit later i'm actually about to order me something to eat because i have not eaten all day so i'm gonna cook a little bit later and um i have not made no seafood salad in so long so long so that's really what i had to taste for i've made a walmart order it's supposed to come between three and four fingers crossed that it come on time also lately i have not been having no issues but before then i was having a lot of issues with walmart delivering the stuff so yeah i placed my walmart order um we're gonna do the reef and what was i about to say oh yeah later make the seafood salad ordering my food <laughs> so i did a thing y'all so i relaxed my hair and i took and I um I flashy rod it. I watched a couple of videos because I just want to know exactly how they do the flashy rod. And let me tell you, I did not do it right. I already know. But I feel like but I feel like it came out kind of okay. But this is another thing I did. After I relaxed my hair, I took and I cut my hair. <laughs> because I had some parts of my head that was really, really long. And I just say lift for me. Because it's just hard because I can't see the back. First of all, I'm not a stylist. But I do a lot of stuff myself. But I can't see. So I just feel like one side is shorter than the other. I really need to just maybe just go to a cutlery, a head cutlery, and just get done to do it and just cut it all one way. Maybe I'll do that. Do they still do that? You know, when they be having like go to the schools and they'll cut it for like a discounted price or something? Yeah, y'all. I think that's what I'm going to do. Yep, that's what I'm going to do. Next, next Thursday, that's going to be part of our vlog. We're going to just go get it cut and just get them to cut it all the same exact length. Like I said, it grows back really fast, so I'm not even worried about it. It's just hair. <laughs> so, yeah, I got to take this apart. I don't know why I didn't bend. I didn't bend. I don't know why I bend didn't do this, but I'm going to have to cut all these things apart because... When 4th of July and every day runs back around, I'm just going to make me a new one anyway. And I need to use this for the, um, 
I need to use this for the um take them apart. For the Valentine's wreath. So yeah. Let's order something to eat. I've been ordering from it's called Wing Plus. I really like that food. I really love that fried rice. And that's definitely something so I'm a, definitely something I need to come back on eating. But um on top of me eating the fried rice today and then making the seafood salad, of course, you know that's noodles. After that, I'm really going to try my best to take a break from um, eating that type of stuff. But, only thing about them, their wings. I just, I don't understand why their wings are so small. So, I, so they had this combo where you get wings, fish, and fried rice. I really didn't want the wings because I feel like I'm about to make me some wings later. So, it's no point. So, I'm going to just do fish and fried rice. The only thing I have not tried is the fish. So be about to try it out. So it's a fish and rice combo where you get you have the option to choose between tilapia and whiting. I love tilapia, but I decided to do whiting. So let's place this order. Hopefully it comes fast because I am hungry. Hungry. See what car they had to about. How much was it? That's not bad. Twenty three dollars. I'm gonna spend thirty dollars. It's crazy what this Uber eats, especially DoorDash. Like you would get something that be like fifteen dollars, twenty dollars. Next thing you know, it's thirty or thirty five dollars. Those fees be ridiculous. That's why I can't wait to a job. Cause times like this, where I need to get something to eat, and I feel like. Cooking. I can just drive to go get some. I don't have to worry about all these feeds. Let's place the order. <sighs> place the order. What's that? I said I was going to say something. I don't know because I always be wanting something to talk about. And every time I come over here, I be forgetting. Yeah, I really like. I like I kind of like how it turned out, but I just don't like how this feel like it's shorter <laughs> than this side. Maybe I should take a picture like this. <laughs> Maybe I'll take a picture like this. <laughs> Remember, do they still do that? I used to watch vlogs and stuff, and people be like, they be recording, and they also just stop. Like, oh come on, stop for a second. They'll stop for a second, and they'll just pose so they can have a thumbnail for that <laughs> picture. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna finish. I'm gonna go ahead and finish taking this thing on day apart. Watch a little bit of TV until my food comes. When my food comes, of course, I'm gonna show y'all how my food look. I feel like it was something else I said I had to do today. I forgot. I know I definitely have a lot of stuff planned for next Thursday, y'all. So, we just, I just decided on that. <laughs> going to get this haircut. I just want to make sure everything is the same exact length. I hope, hopefully they don't mess my hair up. And then, um, what did I say? Oh yeah, we definitely need to go to Trader Joe's. I need to go to Trader Joe's. I really want to find out a place where I could go where I could get not only good fruit, but fruit that's not like an arm and a leg. I'm guessing the only thing I can think of is probably like um, a farmer's market or something. I don't know. I'll figure it out. But I don't want to talk y'all to death. I'm going to take this reef apart so I can get started on it and get started on this video. And then I'm going to, um, when my food come, by the time I'm done this, watch all over TV, my food should be here. And I'm going to come back and I'm going to show you my food. Hey y'all, I'm back. So, the food came. And actually, while I was waiting for the food to come, I made me an appointment. So, I found the hair cuttery. I looked at the reviews. I really, really like the reviews. So, I went on here and I scheduled an appointment with them. Um, and she said it's just going to be $15. I'll take that. 
fifteen dollars because let me go to like a regular place instead of like a, the school whatever a regular place. I'm telling you, I'm probably be paying almost a hundred dollars. Yeah, I definitely should have got two pieces of three pieces of fish. I got two. It's the food. It's the fried rice. You know, see it and then the fish. I've not really been a fan of hush puppies. Oh, my God. Mm, that's okay. Let me try the fifth. Mm. Oh, my God. Try y'all bones. I knew I should have got tilapia. I do not want to deal with this. No daggone bones. It's good, y'all. And then, the drink I got, it's called a three mix. So, what I'm assuming it is, strawberry, lemonade, and peach. Yeah, that's what it looks like, y'all. Let me taste it. But, I should have seen that thing of the store. Oh, right here. But why did they give me four forks? <laughs> why do I need four? I'm watching this vlog, y'all. This Jamaica vlog. Just the one thing that we did not do, me and my sister, is go on a Bob Molly tour. But we definitely going to do that when we go back. Because we definitely going to mess with Jamaica. It's good. That's good. So I'm about to eat this food. Shrimp could have got shrimp could have been a bit bigger. <laughs> but yeah, I'm about to eat this food. And then oh yeah, I changed my mind. I don't think I'm gonna do the roof today. Cause it's my um day off and I really don't be liking when I be having so much to do in one day. As far as like recording and stuff. So I'm gonna definitely do the cooking cooking my seafood salad but as far as the reef we're gonna do that even tomorrow because tomorrow's an easy day for me at work i'm only busy the beginning of the day but not the end of the day so i'll probably do that tomorrow while i'm at work or that way when i get off i don't have to worry about doing it i can just relax if i don't get a chance to do it tomorrow while i'm at work i'm going to do it and um Um, if I don't get a chance to do a while network, I'll just do it when I get off. When I eat my fried rice, y'all, I use duck sauce and soy sauce. <laughs> it's so good. So, yeah, let me eat this food. And finish watching this vlog. This girl, this girl watching now, she, um, she actually, she used to have a job, like, a year ago. And she used to do YouTube as well. But because she used to vlog like every week, she decided that she was making more than enough money doing YouTube. So she quit her job. She bought, she had a house and everything. She she had the little, little minivan where she has everything on there. But uh, making a mess, y'all. She got a stove, um, tub, and, I mean, stove, a little bathroom. But she don't wash up in her bathroom. She always goes to Planet Fitness. But. She sold her house. The car that she had, she sold the car. Well, she gave it to her family friends. I don't even know if she sold it. And she decided to do this full time. She's actually from Detroit. So she started traveling and stuff. And she, so far, when I, since I've been watching her, she traveled so far. She was in Vegas for a minute. She was in um, Florida for a minute. She was, oh, she was in Texas for a minute, and now she actually just left Vegas. Now she's in Jamaica. She took a trip to Jamaica. Of course, she's not going to stay there long. I think she's going to stay there just for, like, a couple of days. But it's just crazy, like, the way the I, the way they talk about how you can, how much money you can make on YouTube. Like, her, she don't do promotions and stuff like that. Like, brand deals and stuff, she don't do that. She literally just post a video every week of what's going on what she doing why she um 
out on the road or whatever state, state she in. And I guess because she got a big following base. A lot. She, she got a lot of subscribers. That's probably why she make that good money. No. Fingers crossed I can be consistent this year. <laughs> I started good last year. Then I ended up well, but I'm going to definitely be consistent. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This rice is so good. I love this rice. All right, I'm going to finish eating. I'm going to talk to you in a minute. <laughs> hey, y'all. Uh, so, groceries came. I'm not going to do a haul. The last video, I did so many daggone hauls. <laughs> oh my gosh, I did that right. I don't know why is it like that. I tried to figure out, is it like some type of setting that I got it on? But, I don't know. But, groceries came on. got a little bit of stuff. Because... I'm going to go grocery shopping. Probably. If I don't get to go this weekend, I'll probably go Thursday. But, only thing, I did order, you know how you have the packs of chicken where it's thighs, legs, and wings. They didn't have it, so I had to get all legs. That's fine. Green peppers, butter, sauces for breakfast. Got some ground turkey. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Look at this small thing. I'm really going to have to make. I did not know it was going to be this small. I'm really going to have to make a. Um, a small. Pot. I mean I didn't want to make a big pot anyway. I just really don't think this tiny thing is going to be enough. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do like a, a um an Instacart order because that's just not gonna be enough. And then the hot sauce. First of all, how they don't have crystal hot sauce. So I got a 12 ounce of the Louisiana hot sauce. Never had this before. And of course they gave me a 32 ounce because it was out of the 12 ounce. Dang, yeah, I really thought that that the crab meat was bigger than that. I think I'm still gonna have to do an Instacart work because at least that way I could order me some wine, the kind of wine I like. <sighs> now, let me place this order real quick and then I'm gonna, um, I think I'm gonna take a quick nap. I'm tired. <laughs> that food got me tired. <laughs> So, I said I was going to take a, um, I said I was going to take a, a nap, but I really didn't. All this time, I was, no, oh, not all this time. Let me stop lying. <laughs> what is going on with my shirt? So, I had, um, I didn't take a nap. So, I ordered, I did order something from Instacart because I felt like I didn't have enough imitation crab meat. So, and I ordered like a couple of other things, and I wasn't looking at the text right, so of course they didn't have it, the invitation crab meat, so I was trying to cancel the order, because I'm like, what is the point? Half the stuff I really didn't need, but um, she said she was like five minutes away, so I couldn't cancel it. So, I actually think what I have is enough, because I'm not making a lot, because it's just for me, only for me, so... I think that's enough, especially on top of me adding shrimp to it too. That should be good. So right now I'm about to cook the shrimp because the shrimp that I had got, it still had the tails on there. So I take the tails off and I got the water boiling for the noodles. And then I didn't even order me no wine because I was like, she gonna want to see our day. I don't feel like doing all that. I think I got a small glass, a small, a little bit from, 
I think I got a little bit. I'm going to just drink that. I don't want to drink it right now, though, because I'm going to be real sleepy. And I need to cook this food real quick. Before I don't feel like doing nothing. I'm watching this vlog with this girl. She spent New Year's Eve. She spent um, the weekend, which was New Year's Eve weekend. In New York. When I say I'm like, I can't wait to go to New York. I don't know why I wanted to go to New York so bad. I want a season. My shrimp with obey and garlic powder. I'm definitely I'm gonna take me a solo trip to New York real soon. I actually still got, a, um, I still got a, um, what they call it, a credit for when I went to Jamaica. I could definitely use it for that. <laughs> I'm going to definitely use it for that. I'm going to use this to cook this shrimp. Butter flavored. So the eggs already done. The shrimp is going to be done in two minutes. <laughs> Extra water. I have to make sure the clean. The chicken is clean, like real clean. Like right now, it's sitting in the, the vinegar and the salt. It's been sitting there for a couple of minutes, couple of hours. About to clean it and then burn the hairs. Want to talk about how I'm in here sweating, sweating. I told y'all, I don't never stop working. I'm working on my day one day all the time. It's almost 8.30. So let me show y'all what I've been up to. So, the chicken is done. I just need to make the buffalo sauce for it. I made the seafood salad. That video is coming up next. And I'm hot. <laughs> I'm sweating, y'all. I swear I'm sweating, but I'm you know, almost done. I just need to make the, um, I'm going to put this seafood salad in. I told you I never had no good lighting. I'm going to put this seafood salad in the, um, refrigerator. And then I'm going to get my buffalo sauce ready so I can eat. And then I'm going to come back and we'll talk a little bit. So let's put this seafood salad in the that chicken, I actually just put that last batch of chicken in. It's almost done. So, um, I'm going to wash these dishes real quick and then I'm going to start on my buffalo sauce. It's okay. Like, it's doable, but I'm not a huge fan of it. It's the oak leaf peanut yeah. I'm gonna move that over here. I'm tired, y'all, and I'm hot. <laughs> Good thing I don't have that many dishes. Oh, you know what? Dishwasher. <laughs> I usually do not use this dishwasher. I mostly wash the dishes in my hand, but we use using a dishwasher today. Yes, we are. <laughs> Hey y'all, um, so I'm finally done. So I was like, let me sit at this table where I literally never sit. I'm going to taste it with y'all. When I say I have not made this in so long. So good. 
choke it. Not for me. Mm. So I call this honey obey. Mm, honey obey. Honey mild. Mm. I made a barbecue sauce. Um, barbecue sauce. I made a buffalo sauce. I will always do it, but I always add teriyaki sauce in mine. And then with this time, I put some honey in it. Banger. It's so good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm hot, but today was a good day. I really enjoyed today. That's all I did was post. That's all I did was record, but it still, I feel like it still was a good day. So, um, yeah, it was definitely a good day. So, I think, sorry, but today is going to be a short vlog. <laughs> Next week, Maybe a little bit longer because I do have a few things to do. Y'all know I gotta get the head cut, whatever, and then I want to run a fruit errand. So next week might be longer, but I just want to try my best to keep remaining consistent and stuff like that. And the crazy part is sometimes I just don't like don't feel like recording, but like since this year started, I feel like I just been really really motivated. And the crazy part about it, the fun part about it with me. It's editing. I love editing it. <laughs> it's just I gotta get myself be more consistent. Like I don't have a New Year's resolution. You know, people who used to be doing that and stuff like that. But I not really had one. But for me, for for sure, I was talking to my sister about this. I just want to continue to be consistent. Consistent with everything. Like consistent with the YouTube thing, cause I like doing this. You know, I really like doing it. So consistent with that. Don't let me like nothing like get me off track and stuff like that. And consistent with really doing what I need to do for our saving money. So I can get the stuff that I really want. Like a vehicle. And after a vehicle, definitely a house. So yeah, just being consistent with everything. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do this year. Well, I'm going to finish eating this food. I don't, I don't, I don't like eating. While I'm talking to y'all, so I'm gonna finish eating this food, and I don't know if I'm gonna come back after this. Um, I don't know. I might, I might not. I don't know. It depends on how I feel. Ain't <laughs> hey, brand. I'm only chasing after bags. Now I got a game plan, and I'm out here.